Right now, state leaders and community members of all ages and backgrounds are working to stop bullying. There's an event starting right now at Discovery World to raise money for the nonprofit Generations Against Bullying. Julia Fellow shows us how that organization is having an impact. Suicide is one of the leading causes of death for children 14 and younger. An eight year old Racine boy is sharing his personal experience with bullying, offering hope and to save lives. I know what it feels like to be bullied. It is a journey Caden Saunders has already gone through. His bully taunted him in kindergarten. And he pushed me down. Since they were the same kids every single year, it kept getting worse and worse. His mother, Nanette, connected with Generations Against Bullying. They helped him to uh, manage his stress. The difficult decision to move to a different school in the Mount Pleasant area changed everything. It's way better. It's, and it's way easier to make friends there. The organization uses advocates like Miss Wisconsin Teen to show children not to be a bystander to bullying, but an upstander. It's really amazing to talk to the younger kids. She shares with them her experience of being bullied in the third grade because she had a lisp. I just tell them that the teachers are really there to help. Caden now sticks up for his classmates who are picked on. He has advice for other children. My advice is to try to ignore them. The funds raised from tonight's event will help the organization hold more programs at schools and communities throughout southeast Wisconsin. Reporting at the Lakefront, Julia Fellow, today's TMJ4. Decision 20